What's going on, everybody? All right. I want to give a big thanks and big shout out to Louie. You guys want to watch this? This is going to be amazing. Get this game on PC and get ready to get this. All right. If you don't like playing online, this is for you. All right. I'm going to go through this video. This is by Louie. So I'm going to have the link to the original video here so you guys can come and leave a comment. Leave a comment on my video and leave a comment on his video. You guys get ready. This is about to be amazing. All right. So we're going beyond next gen. You feel me? All right. Let's let's go ahead and make this thing full screen. Uh, turn the music down. Let's press play. You guys are not going to be able to hear the music, so that's cool. So you guys are looking at this. Hop. First thing first, we're in black top mode. Then you see this. You see this come up. All right. It says general. Allow same player to be selected multiple times. Ah, you can't do that. You cannot do that normally. You can't select the same player multiple times. So, let's see what he does. See, he's going to enable it. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. I didn't even see this. All right, you can select your stadium, clothing, and settings. Okay, let's see what else this man got in here. Look at this. Oh, yes, this is about to go crazy. This is about to go crazy. I've created, I don't know, I've got a whole list of... I don't know how many environments. Look, 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 look. Let me see. I'm going to go all the way down. I've created like, oh my, not just me, but other people too. I mean, this is over 100 different environments over here. Ah, I got to make it go crazy. All right. Anyway, so you'll be able to, you know, select your, select whatever arena you want to play in or environment you want to play in. And you can set it here. Oh, this finna go crazy. All right. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. He selected a random one. Then he says you can select clothing. Uh, all right, let's see what he does. He's going to pick Joel and B. All, everybody's Joel and B. You couldn't do that before. All right, so now he disabled that. Let's see. He's setting, he's changing the clothing of Tobias Harris. Look at this. Over here. You're going to have different options. You can pick any jersey you want them to wear. No more of that black top stuff. You can have it like next gen where they wear the warm ups. Oh, this finna go crazy. I'm excited, man, because I, I was losing motivation to really deal with some, you know, to really deal with 2K. I was starting to lose motivation. And I, I'll talk about that in another video. But this man has come back and restored my faith because I love playing black top mode but he named these naked they just mean shirtless but um i love playing black top mode i don't like playing online i'm just be real with you guys i don't like going online and trying to level up and all of that spinning vc like i i used to love it back in 2k16 but i got a bad taste in my mouth in 2k17 where my player got corrupted twice and i had already spent money multiple times and i couldn't figure out how to get them back so, like, after that, I never spent VC again. I stopped playing online. Didn't care about leveling up anyway. So, this is what I need. And since we're on PC, we can play this against each other. We can use this, and we can play this against each other using Parsec. Okay, so maybe we use Parsec and Discord to get the audio. Use Discord for the audio. Use Parsec to play against each other and basically this becomes an online mode. Alright. Oh man, so you can add an outfit? Is that how it works? I don't know. I guess that is how it works. Yeah, you can create an outfit. Oh, this finna go crazy. This finna go crazy. Oh, this man went insane. Now, I already donated towards this before I even knew that he was making this. Like, as soon as he came out with his first set of tools for 2K22 on PC, I, I went ahead and donated for the tool. And then I went ahead and donated again to have, you know, I was like, hey, man, I'm trying to, you know, I wanted to make, I wanted to create something similar to this like I did in 2K20. But with him making a tool, an entire tool, for this, this is insane. We going crazy. At least I am, man. I'm going crazy. You guys know I love the black top. 
having custom stuff. I mean, now I, I used to love retro. I used to love retro teams, but I played 2K for so many years. Like my time when I used to play retro was before I was even on YouTube. I spent years playing retro rosters, years. And so now I don't, I see, you know, I see guys like Dom 2K, he'll stream retro rosters. And I see a lot of, uh, I see a few YouTubers, they'll like, they'll sim from, let's say the two, early 2000s to now, or they'll sim from the past to now. I, I've done all of that before I was ever even on YouTube. I did all of that. I've played, uh, I played a 60s association mode in the 60s with Wilt Chamberlain. Uh, I've done all that. This right here, this stuff is fire. All right, so let me see. What else does he have? You can pick the shoes, the socks. You can add accessories. Oh, he got the WNBA stuff in there? Oh, no, that's for men, though. Uh, I'm going to figure out a way to get the females in here. If he doesn't add it for the females, I'm going to figure out a way to get the females in here. I'm just telling you right now. Boy, he went crazy. And I'm sure this is going to be a paid uh, plug-in. You're probably going to have to pay for this, which it looks like it's well worth it to me. This looks well worth it to me. You know what? I need to go back and see. What was that? He had... All right, so he got stadiums. Then he goes to edit. Okay, so you can change the name of a stadium, stadium file, select the floor file that goes with it, stadium file type, crowd type, location type. Oh, man, he going crazy. He's going crazy. Look at this, y'all. Look what he did. Now, we can play 1v1s, 2v2s, 3v3, 4v4, 5v5. It's just pick up. And then I know it's people out there that, people like Wes, they've already made, like, uh, recreational gyms like rec centers la fitness stuff like that um somebody tried to emulate it might have been west terminal 23 and like i showed y'all i already got about 100 environments that's created that's non-nba stadiums Boy, this is about to go crazy all right i'm about to get off of here you guys go show love to hit the original video this is about to go crazy. Again, we can play this online with friends. We can, um, hold on. Oh, he got the mask and the goggles. Oh, we going crazy, bro. Plus, imagine the lighting, because different environments is going to have different lighting. You guys need to get over to my channel. Let me go to my channel. You need to get over to my channel and find every, every custom court you can, man. I'm telling you, all you got to do is go to my channel come up here you can just search either court or you know i'm gonna I'm just type in court like i got so many court videos like this one the waterfall court uh this one that i made a while ago man like look at this custom little part i got all kind of stuff uh nah, let me let me get off of that got this one yeah. parking lot court where they looking like cartoons. Now, this is going to be on 2K22 now. Uh, got this one. You can play in here. I already released all this stuff, man. Look, rooftop. Somebody, this was from somebody else, though. Uh, man, we're going to have so many, so many ways to play. Let me try to find some more. Find some more. You feel me? Look, I released this one earlier. Um... Like, I don't know how many weeks. This was on December 5th. So it's finna go crazy. It's finna go crazy. We're about to go crazy. I want to see y'all playing this stuff. Look at my custom courts, y'all. Trying to tell y'all. Look at my custom courts. Let me go to this Kobe court. Look at that court. We can mix and match the floors with different environments. Like, guys, you're going to be able to use all this stuff I ever put out. You can play you can play in here if you want to. Let me show you. Nah, you can play in this gym or 
You can play in this gym, and it's going. You can have whatever, whatever outfit you want. Man, we about to go crazy. Then you can use the course from the infamous NY that he released over the years. Bro, I'm going crazy. This is it. Got the draft combine court. You can play there. Then when this high school mod finally come out, it's going to go crazy too. College mod come out, it's going to go crazy. Boy, this, this, this renews my faith. Not renews my faith. Let me not say that. But it, it motivates me again. Look at this. I made this. It's already released. We're gonna be hooping everywhere. So we let's let's do this community. Let's do it. No VC. You don't have to pay for VC. No VC. You don't not have to pay for VC. I had a game on next gen. I don't play it. I stopped playing it. I'm sure they might have fixed the issues by now that I was having, but I stopped playing it. Once I run into too many issues, I just stopped playing. Like stuff like this, I'll show you. Stuff like this, like let me show you on next gen. It's just little stuff that just add up. Like look at their shirts, man. Jerseys is clipping through the shirts. They don't get a ring ceremony. I'm not even mad about it, but it's just little ugly stuff like that. Like why would they jerseys be clipping through the shirts? That's ugly. I couldn't even take a screenshot or make a real video out of it. Like that's ugly. Um, it's other little issues that I was having, like training not working, stuff like that. They might have fixed it, but it doesn't matter at this point. Anyway, man, I'm about to get up out of here. Y'all know who it is. I'm the goods. Maybe I should bring this WNBA. I mean the the female college rosters back. Y'all know I a lot of people don't even know I did that. Made that last year. W, it was the female college rosters. Anyway, we about to go crazy, man. We about to go crazy. And not only, man, I ain't even going to give y'all no ideas because then I know somebody will take it. I was about to say something else you could end up doing with Louis Tool, but I know people will take that idea and run with it, profit off of it, and I'm good. I'm going to hold that to myself for now. Bringing Hoodie Mellow back out. I was the first one with that Hoodie Mellow, bringing it back out. Bro, this is about to go crazy. Big shout-out to Louie. Big shout-out to the modern community. Big shout-out to the NBA 2K PC community for keeping this game low cost. You feel me? Y'all go get the game. About to go crazy. Come back. Subscribe to the channel. I'm gone.